let's see what reagents and supplies are required for Bradford assay to determine the protein concentration. Here, if we have to prepare this standard curve, we need standards that is bovine serum albumin solution of different concentration so that we can use that protein sample for preparation of standard curve because we know what concentration of these solutions are. Then we need the breadfood reagent that is the commissive brilliant blue stain. We need methanol, we need phosphoric acid. These three reagents are going to be used to prepare the breadfood reagent. How we can prepare this reagent? We need to be very careful because it uses the phosphoric acid, a strong acid. We have to be very careful when we need to prepare this reagent. For that purpose, we take 50 milligrams of massive brilliant blue stain. G250 is its number or its code number. And we dissolve it in 50 milliliter of methanol. So stain is 50 milligram in 50 milliliter of ethanol and then we add 100 milliliter of 85 percent phosphoric acid weight by volume is ka solution banta hai this solution is then used for final volume preparation up to one liter for that purpose we take this acid solution and we add it in 850 milliliter of water we add it slowly and we let the stain mix up. There is the critical step. We need to add the acid solution into the water. Don't add water into the acid solution. It can create problem. Once the volume up to one liter is ready and it appears that all the commissive blue stain powder stain is dissolved in that particular volume then we can filter it using the Wattman number one filter paper which is one of the requirement for uh, in the reagents and supplies and after filtration we have to store this stain in a dark bottle either you can use brown bottle or if brown bottle is not available there is availability of transparent bottle that bottle should be covered by aluminium foil so that this stain should not be exposed to the light and it remains stable for its function. The storage temperature for this particular stain is at 4 degrees centigrade. Besides this reagent we need spectrophotometer for absorbance optical density measurement then we need vertex mixer we need Wattman number one filter paper for filtration step glass funnel and the protein samples for which we have to determine the concentration that is the unknown concentration samples of proteins.